Google just released an AI code editor that's completely free and comes with Gemini 3 Pro built right in. I'm going to show you exactly how to download and install it in the next few minutes. Let's dive in. Before we install it, let me quickly show you what you're getting. This is Google Antigravity. It looks similar to VS Code, but the game changer is this built-in AI assistant powered by Gemini 3 Pro, Google's latest model. Watch this, I can ask Gemini anything directly in the editor. Gemini will now generate the requested code for me, as shown on screen. Alright, let's get you set up. First, open your browser and search for antigravity.google, that's the official site. As I mentioned, this is the official site for antigravity, so you can learn how to get started right from this website. Once you're here, click on pricing in the navigation menu. You'll see the individual plan is completely free, no credit card, no trial period, genuinely free. This shows you everything included, Gemini 3 Pro access, code completion, chat features, all at no cost. Now, click on the download button. Now select your operating system. I'm on Windows, so I'll click download for Windows. The installer will start downloading automatically. Once the download completes, navigate to your downloads folder or wherever your browser saves files. Right click on the setup file and select open. When you're asked to confirm if it can be installed for all users, click OK to continue. The installer will launch. First, you'll see the terms of service, take a moment to read through them, then check the box to accept and click next. The next screen shows the installation location. The default location works perfectly fine, so I'll leave it as is and click next. The program's shortcut will be created in this start menu folder, so click next. Now you can choose your installation preferences. Create a desktop shortcut if you want quick access. Add to Windows Explorer context menu for right-click options. You can keep the defaults or customize this however you prefer, then click Next when ready. Final confirmation screen, click Install and let it work. This takes about 30 seconds to a minute depending on your system. Just let it complete. Nice! Installation complete. Make sure Launch Antigravity is checked, then click Finish. The setup wizard opens. Click next to begin configuration. You can import settings from VS Code if you're migrating, or start fresh. I'll choose start fresh for this tutorial. Choose your preferred theme. We've got dark, night, light, and several others. I'm choosing the Tokyo night theme, it's easy on the eyes. Select yours and click next. This is where anti-gravity really shines. You can choose agent-driven development, full AI automation, Agent Assistant Development, Recommended Balance of AI Help and Manual Control, Review Driven Development, or Customize How Much AI Involvement You Want. The recommended setting is perfect for most users. Leave the terminal and other options at default, then click Next. Editor Configuration, choose between Normal, Vim, or Emacs Key Bindings. Unless you have a specific preference, stick with Normal. Seven essential extensions will install automatically, these are recommended for the best experience. Click Next. Now you need to authenticate with your Google account to access Gemini. Click Sign In with Google. Then select your Gmail account and click Sign In. A browser pop-up will appear asking for permissions. Check the box to authorize, then click Open Antigravity. Back in the setup window, review the final terms of service, make sure the checkbox is selected, and click Next to complete setup. And we're in. Welcome to Google Antigravity. The interface is familiar if you've used VS Code, you've got your file explorer on the left, terminal at the bottom, and the main editor area in the center. You can also install your favorite extensions the same way you do in VS Code. Just search for the extension name, then click Install. When asked for permission, click Trust Publisher and Install. The extension will be installed successfully. Now, let's see how you can work with a project folder. First, create a project folder anywhere on your computer. Back in the editor, click on Open Folder and select the project folder you just created.
Let's create an index.html file just for testing. Now, this is where the magic begins. Go to the right side where you see the agent panel, then select the model you want. I highly recommend Gemini 3 Pro High for the best results. In this input field, let's ask, can you complete index.html by adding a responsive table and use Bootstrap to build the UI? Then, click this button to submit the request. The AA will start thinking, analyzing, and working on the task we've given it. Gemini responds instantly with detailed. Be patient until you see the completion message. If the AI asks you anything, just respond and click the submit button. This is the power of having AI built directly into your development environment. Right now, index.html hasn't been updated yet, just wait. As you can see, the color of index.html changed, that means there are modifications to the file. Well done! Our index.html has been updated exactly as we requested from our AI agent. This page now includes Bootstrap 5 CSS framework, custom CSS properties for styling the UI, and a Google Fonts URL. When you're happy with the results, click Accept Changes. Anti-Gravity Code Editor is awesome for boosting programmer productivity. Let's preview the index.html file. Right-click and open it in your favorite browser. As you can see, we now have this beautiful page UI with a responsive table. That's it. You now have Google Anti-Gravity installed with full Gemini 3 Pro access, completely free. If you found this helpful, drop a like and let me know in the comments what you're planning to build with Antigravity. See you in the next one.